Energizing your soul through the inspired Word of God. This is your daily devotional reading. Our High Calling, a devotional by Ellen White. June 10th, one with the church above. The church has one foundation, tis Jesus Christ her Lord. She is his new creation by water and the word. From heaven he came and sought her to be his holy bride. With his own blood he bought her, and for her life he died. One with the church above. For this cause I bow my knees unto the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, of whom the whole family in heaven and earth is named. Ephesians chapter 3 verses 14 and 15. The church of God upon the earth is one with the church of God above. Believers on the earth and those who have never fallen in heaven are one church. Every heavenly intelligence is interested in the assemblies of the saints, who on earth meet to worship God in spirit and truth and in the beauty of holiness. In the inner court of heaven, they listen to the testimonies of the witnesses for Christ in the outer court on earth, and the praise and thanksgiving that comes from the church below is taken up in the heavenly anthem, and praise and rejoicing resounds through the heavenly court, because Christ has not died in vain for the fallen sons of Adam. While angels drink from the fountainhead, the saints on earth drink of the pure streams flowing from the throne of God, making glad the city of God. In every assembly of the saints below are the angels of God listening to the thanksgiving, the praise, the supplication that is offered by the people of God in testimonies, songs, and prayers. Let them remember that their praises are supplemented by the choirs of the angelic host above. The company of believers may be few in number, but they have been taken by the cleaver of truth as rough stones from the quarry of the world to be fitted up by test and trial for a place in God's heavenly temple, and they are very precious in the sight of the Lord, even in the rough. They are precious in the sight of God. The axe and the hammer and the chisel of trial and test are in the hands of one who is skillful and are used not to destroy, not to bring to nothingness, but to work out the perfections of every soul. The Lord will no more cast off the humblest, lowliest believer in Jesus than he will demolish his throne. We are accepted in the Beloved. We are members of the royal family, children of the heavenly King, heirs of God, and joint heirs with Christ Jesus. Our High Calling, June 10th. I encourage you to be ye doers of the word and not hearers only. Thank you for listening and be sure to join us tomorrow for your daily devotional reading.